fact that you use two cameras that's really crucial to making improvisation work and making sure we can film friends and fireworks in a single night. In an actual conversation, of course, people are going to talk over each other. It's not like they're waiting for the next person to speak and to say their line. So you will get overlapping dialogue and it's something you have to be prepared for. In that scene, we actually have cutaways to the ocean and the ocean waves are crashing and that's symbolising the tumultuous nature of their relationship. So that for me is a meaningful cutaway, something that actually adds to the story or complements the story. With this schedule, it wasn't just one overall schedule for the shoot, it was actually individual schedules for everyone. The crew in particular, the production assistants, had their own individual schedules because they were in charge of transportation. Shooting is reflecting services in regards to shooting like near an oven or you know a toaster that's shiny and stainless steel. You can get dulling spray. It's an art department trick of the trade. I'm a big believer in the saying that a film is actually made in the cutting room. actually do sit down with the actors one-on-one. -on -one. We do give them questions about their character a few days before, so they've had time to think about it. So when they come back to us, they do have a better idea of their character and what fits for their character that we've written and what doesn't fit and what we have to eliminate. It's key in film to absorb the audience in the world that you're creating. And if they see a boom shadow or a mic or a stand in the corner, that just breaks the illusion of the world and it's so much more difficult to get them back at that stage. So do your best, strive for perfection.